There's an end in sight. A bridge in Tupelo has been shut down for almost four months, and some businesses say they're losing foot traffic because of it. WTVA's Jake White is live now with what's new. That's right, this local bridge here in West Tupelo has been in closure for about four months. I spoke to some local businesses around West Tupelo who say they feel left behind. Take a look. It's hurting all of our businesses. Since August, a bridge in West Tupelo has been out of commission. And on Tuesday night, the city of Tupelo started taking bids on fixing the bridge. But for some businesses, they feel like... It's ridiculous that they just started taking bids on this less than a month or two ago. And this bridge has been out since August. I mean, what's the holdup? Why, why is it taking so long? And you might be saying to yourself, well, this is just one bridge in the city of Tupelo. Well, it's not really the case because this bridge behind me here connects counties such as Lafayette and Pontotoc, which gives foot traffic to these businesses that they're not getting anymore. And she's not the only business in the area that feels this way. Um, we can definitely see an impact on our sales. I mean, they have definitely dropped due to this, and especially here at the holidays, that's really affected us. I certainly feel, and so do the other owners in this area, feel that if it was in another area of town with more prominent businesses, that it would have definitely been taken care of and moved a lot faster. It's just, it's an inconvenience for my customers, not only that, but my employees. All my employees are from Pontotoc, so it's just a, it's a real inconvenience. Construction is expected to start in February of 2024. That means that these businesses could be waiting until July to November for this bridge that fuels their businesses to reopen. Of course, we will keep you updated here on WTVA 9 News or on the WTVA News app. But for now, life here in Tupelo, Jake White, WTVA 9 News.